My name is Jose Abinacer, and I'm 39 years old, and I want to be a boxer. I thought I was going to be able to work out at least three times this week. I only worked out that one day. So basically, I'm in no shape still. This is my van. This is where I'm staying at the present time. It's a fucking mess here because I have a couple of plans to organize it a little. Because when you live in a small place like this, there is no room for much, not room for much, so I need to make a couple of adjustments here so I can put some things away and not have this mess around me at all times, which I can't stand. Oh, that hurt. Hands are really crisp. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. Uh, Heavy hands too. It snaps every time almost. We just put together our third week workout with uh, Matt Janser. Um, he's a Muay Thai coach for Brazilian top team. And we did some Muay Thai drills. I'd never done them before and they were pretty interesting. I liked it because, you know, the coordination, the balance. It adds, a, you know, it just adds a, an extra level of difficulty to an already difficult sport. You know, because you got to be in shape to go to the gyms here, you know, they'll kick your ass. You go over there out of shape and, you know, they'll so that, that'll be their time to shine. <laughs> they'll, put, they'll put you on your ass just so they can look good. So, so you gotta have that in mind before you get into any boxing gym. You gotta have in mind, you need to have your win straight. Week two, we went to a park with a huge hill, and you know we've been we've been basically running drills these past two weeks. Uh, there was a nice little hill in that second week where we did some good work, but again I hadn't worked. That, that was my second workout in in over a year, so I'm not sure I produced much that day either. It's been a little harder than I expected. At the beginning, I expected to bounce back like I used to, where I could just spring up at five in the morning, jump into my sneakers and go out and run. You know, now I wake up and it's like, ah, uh, snooze. I hit the snooze button and we go back to, uh... I guess, I don't know when I'm gonna start with the diet. Staying in the van all week long. Some things I gotta do to it. It's starting to get complicated. I got a lot of shit piled up now. <laughs> I work on the van, I gotta work out. We're in the middle of the season, so work is busier than, you know, as busy as it's gonna get. So things are piling up. I did say at the beginning that work wasn't gonna be a, a factor. I think it is gonna be a factor. Because when they, I got to go in at 5 in the morning, that means I got to be up by 3.45. I'm not going to run before that. And like the other day, I went in at 5. I didn't get out till 9 o'clock at night. And I had to go back in at 5 in the morning again, so. But I'll do it. I've done it before. <laughs> 